Okay, lesson one is to link the click with the treat. We want, in the puppy's mind, we want um, the click to, to be synonymous with getting a treat, and that's because the click allows you to mark a behavior the very second it occurs. So the puppy really knows, oh, that's the thing you want. And if you're fumbling to get the treat out of your pocket, um, it's okay because you already marked the right behavior instantaneously with your clicker. Or if you don't have a clicker in your hand, you can say, yes, in a really dramatic way, not the way you say yes in a sentence so that the puppy doesn't hear it all day. It has to be, yes in a special way that um, the puppy knows, oh, that thing, that's that thing I'm working for. Um, so let's see it. I happen to have a puppy here. And the first lesson is simply click, treat, click, treat, click, treat. The puppy doesn't have to do a thing. So the puppy will do really well at this. Okay. Really, look what happened. Yeah. Look at that. And we're using very soft, very tiny treats. So she's learning, wow, when that click thing happens, look what happens. I get a little treat. Hmm. Do you think she's going to like the sound of the clicker? That's the goal. So we're just going to do this a few times. Um, and she's going to learn really fast. Like later today, if she hears a click, she's going to come running. Because she just learned that as soon as she hears that sound, it's a predictor of a young treat coming. So that's lesson number one, so practice that.